Crabby Bill here. Sunday night, Whitehaven, Pennsylvania, Crabby's Mountain Spot. And guess what? The thunderstorms are following me. Trees are just starting to blow up. Got some warnings coming over to TV. Uh, when I got here today, the uh, antenna here was turned around 90 degrees. So I had no TV. So I just put it back onto where I have a mark here. That's so I could get, get TV, which isn't working. Just moved it back into location. I talked to one of the neighbors and they said, besides the number of bears, the uh, broken pole bear, there is a bear with three legs and there is a, uh, a female bear with two cubs all floating around up here. Uh, the, the thunderstorm that they had the other day, so the wind was blowing 56 mile an hour, 50 to 60 mile an hour. And that's probably what turned my um, antenna around. But you can see the pond is looking good. Uh, Phil Barr from Barr's Construction came down here with me and uh, used his excavator to dredge it out. Here's something moving around over here. So he said, uh, keep a an eye out. There's lots and lots of bears. But I haven't pulled my camera cards in weeks. So I should get in there and do that. The ticks have been so bad, I don't feel like walking down there. We'll see. The pond is looking good. If we get this thunderstorm, I'll try to come out and get some video of the uh, the water going in it. Uh, the day that Phil dredged it for me, uh, we had a thunderstorm just as we finished. We had an inch and a half of rain or an inch and a quarter of rain in like 45 minutes. The pond was boiling over the top. Um, there's very, very few fish left in it, but I currently have a pizza in the oven and a couple of beers in the fridge. I'm going to go in there and mess with this TV, see what I can get on there. If I can't, I'm going to go on YouTube, Southpaw 210. It's got a video out. Deer camp. Got to check it out. So we'll, uh, we'll check back with you later, see what happens with this thunderstorm. I saw that the uh, <clears throat> spotlights went on. Obviously tripped by a couple of deer. Nice size doe. There's yeah, something's going on here. I keep looking up at my window here. I'm gonna let them be. Crabby Bill here. That's right, another porterhouse. After a long day of work at Bars Construction, I'm out here having a porterhouse steak and a cold beer on the griddle. Beautiful day today. Worked on a little deck job. Nothing, uh, nothing too crazy. Didn't get a chance to do any videotaping at all, though. I just accidentally shut the video off, hit the wrong button. I'm out here now, just had a nice shower. It's like 7.30, just getting a dinner. First thing I ate all day, getting a good sear on this porterhouse. Got some mac and cheese cooking in there. Gonna have some asparagus with it. But you know what? No blueberry pie in there, and no tasty cake eclair pie, no dessert whatsoever. I don't know what's going on with Krabby. I'm gonna have to have a chat with her. But I do have a question is this weed. Let me see it come around this way here. Look at the size of this weed that sprung up here. What the heck is that? Anybody knows, please leave a comment. I think it's going to take over. It's probably Jack looking for his beanstalk here. Keeping an eye out for bears down there. I haven't seen any yet. There's some deer out here last night. As you see, I'll have that on the video too. But uh, I'm just going to uh, take care of this steak. Check back. Geez, I'm starting to think I need uh, 
crabby in every video to have something that's entertaining. Here I am. All I'm doing again is getting ready to throw a couple of pork chops on the griddle. Having a cold beer, mind you. Waiting for the griddle to get nice and hot again. I just, uh, as usual, sprayed it down with water after uh, getting it up to temperature. I like to, uh, to clean it before I use it. Especially while I'm up here, because you never know what's walking around down here. Well, it's another day working for Phil Barr. Look at that. Just felt that on my neck. Hmm. It's the second one today. I was cutting the grass. I guess it came out of the umbrella here. But I was cutting the grass, and uh, when I went in to get a shower, I had a tick on my belly. My big old fat belly. That's right, I saw a little tick on there. So, worked for Phil Barr today. Uh, mostly doing demo. Nice job in uh, Tamaqua, Pennsylvania. It's pretty nice. It's uh, not far from the Glassburn Inn, which is where Krabby and I were last week. But really don't have anything entertaining. Nothing's happened yet. Uh, just working hard. I don't use the, uh, I try not to use my phone at all while I'm working. Really didn't get any video. Um, well, we'll see what happens here. Going home tomorrow, pick up Krabby. Heading for North Wildwood, New Jersey. Stephen and Canoli. Coming for the holiday. Looking forward to it. And check back. Ah! Alright everybody, here I am. Come to save the video. Yeah. Her crabby Bill over there was complaining. Um, complaining? I was saying that I didn't have anything good for the video. Well, here I am. I don't know how much better, but I'm here. We're on our way to the shore. Fourth of July weekend, sort of middle of the week, leading to the weekend. And uh, plenty of traffic today. Plenty of really wow. irresponsibly bad drivers. Crazy drivers. Though. Crazy drivers. I mean, we almost got hit three times before we even got on the bridge. So, uh, right now we're coming to a standstill. <laughs> So I guess it's going to be touch and go the rest of the way. We just about made it. We're about a mile from Ocean City, New Jersey. I'm um, hoping that everybody gets off here um, so we can get moving, get down there, and get Peyton. Yeah, this is one of my favorite spots, too, that we're driving by. This is when you know you're going to the beach for the weekend or whatever, the week, whatever, the day. It's the spot where you know... You're heading to the beach. It's all marshland with the intercoastal waterway going through. And then we're going to come around the bend here. And there's going to be the same thing, but you're going to see a big marina in the background. Then you're going to go over to Egg Harbor Bridge. Really, really nice. That's when you know you're heading to the beach. So, I guess we have a couple days of painting. We'll see how that goes. Hopefully better than last week. And, uh, we have a benefit for a friend on Sunday. So we'll be headed out Sunday for a little bit of fun. Um, maybe we'll uh, set the pool up this weekend. We'll see what happens. Anything? Not. Not. Got not. Just like Jake the Fox. Thumbs up. Not. Check back.